something just to lift it. Go on, go on. Uh, what do you find are the biggest issues when lads are building these kind of walls? What are the most mistakes they make or what are the simplest mistakes lads make? The simplest mistakes? It's, I think maybe pan, uh, rushing. I think if they're starting off as beginners, I think it's, it's rushing, maybe it's only human nature. But I think it's rushing, I suppose it looks better if you have a lot of stones up. But it's usually the matter of just turning the stone an extra time. The stones in general, a lot of them are, are right for the for the place, but they probably just need torn to level them off a wee bit, you know. Mm. Like you can see there, look, them stones, them two men of them stones in, but that stone we moved there. It just had to be turned around the body and a wee cog down the other side mm. to leave it level, and that was that right. I think that's one of the most of the mistakes they make. Yeah, rushing the job. I think, well, I think it's going to be a bit fast. I think as well as that experience, if you're getting half decent stones, we're managing not too bad. Aye. But when we're getting out of the when we're good, mates, Well, the, as I know. said earlier, the, any ditch is only as good as the stones. You know, uh, to me, uh, a ditch, uh, it's better if you can pick the stones for the hole rather than using too many cogs. Aye. But it takes longer. It's not really, it's not like a faced wall in a house. Right. Okay. Oh, no, no, I'm only saying, you know. Yeah. You know, you can battle that way. This stone here. Look at the way that's sloping. Need, need to be rubbed that, eh? You understand? Mm. Now, probably shouldn't be saying this. Me and Tom, but you might get away with that, but if you, the problem is when you're only starting, if you build that way there, yeah. your next one's going to get worse. Before you know it, you're lying. No, that stone, you hear that stone's not even wrong. I'd be putting that end down. Okay. Right. I'd be putting that down. With this is this stone's been put in and there's been a cog put in that end which is putting the stone to a slope. That stone needs to be leveled down so rather than you try and cut down on cogs and lift them up here and it won't be balanced. If you take that cog out, that's just what you want. Turn the stone around the body. Right, and then put, put, put the cog on this side. Then we're left, well, this bit here is built okay, this cog here is, well it's less and also something can, something can, something can catch it. A sheep or something could rub on it and that'll fall out. If that falls out, that stone's, if that ditch has been ready but it was built, that stone's going to be wobbling and the whole thing will fall again. 